Uh, hi guys, I heard y'all wanted me to make another full day of eating video, full day of putting food in my mouth hole video. Well, guess what? Today is gonna be that day, boys. Starting with the mandarino. Oh, mmm, lovely. These are actually so good, man. Unfortunate thing is, yeah, that there's a pit in here. Other unfortunate thing is. That we don't have any more time to make coffee, so I have to get coffee at the gym. Uh, hey, uh. Now it's making two coffee. No, back. No. Oh my gosh. Um, this is stressful. Okay, I'm get another cup, and I'm just gonna put that under once the thing does the thing. Once it's full. Whoop. Okay, okay, that worked. That worked. This is nasty ass coffee, dude. There's like, it's only like tea. I kind of want to taste it though. Ah, oh, look at it. Looks like apple juice. <laughs> That's disgusting. <clears throat> but that means we get a little bit of extra caffeine, which we need for this early morning session. If you're doing what everyone else is doing, you're doing it wrong. Now that we got that out of the way, I can grind on the vault again. I've actually studied a lot of vaults. And right now I'm just trying to like make a combination between um, between Yang Wei. He was the Olympic champion from 2008 and world champion in 6 and 07. And the Tsuki triple from Vernayev. If I can like replicate those a little bit, then it's very successful. But like on vault, it's just so hard to make like these changes on vault for me. Uh, but it has been going pretty decent, so let's see if we can continue their progress today. Doesn't that look ridiculous? Well, it's actually pretty useful for me. But if I do this, then I can feel the entire one side of the spectrum. Instead of making small changes every time, I just want to do it completely one way and then completely the other way and then find like a mix. So the normal way I can do it, but I can only go up to like two and a half. So now I want to like completely switch it up, like not even go any, any flip rotation. And then eventually I can like combine these two techniques or something. And then we do easy Tsuki triple twist. Well, that's the plan at least. Alright, and now we are gonna try one with like a full run up. So from now on, I only did like from 18 meters. Now we're gonna do it with a full run up and just see like if we can keep the same technique. You see, boys? Now it's all like kind of, kind of starting to come together once I add more speed and stuff and I can keep the technique the same. But now I can't really like fully twist as fast as I can normally twist. But I do go like way higher than normally. So like this technique and then just like, basically I'm, basically what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to, uh, how do I explain this? Get off the horse really piked. So then I can pull my shoulders up and go really high. And then immediately I can already start to twist. Because normally I make like half a twist the other way and then start twisting, which is like really in, in, inefficient. Everything on fold just happens in, in one second. And you need to look put all your pointers and things you have to think about in that one second, which is like, that's the hardest thing for me in fault. Like I can do all the things separately, but like once I have to add it all together, it just gets really complicated. Switch inside. Yeah. Okay, 
finished training. I also got a haircut, and now I'm here with my dad because we are hanging up. Well, actually, he is hanging up <laughs> so some shelves. I'm always hanging up shelves. <laughs> so we have this shelf here now, and then I also want to hang a shelf like here, but I want like a shelf for all my coffee stuff. Oh, and we we have the sandwich. I have one with goat cheese and and walnuts and stuff and he has brie oh and we have coffee Bronsak, my my um beans are almost out so if you could send some new ones that'd be great <laughs> done we done here we also hang the lamp a little bit higher so now I have my coffee and stuff over there Boop. still need to do the dishes but I will do that later okay so now we have my coffee stuff here and then over here I placed my subscriber trophies these are all the things that I got from subscribers except for this one I got this one in Japan when I was there but all, all those things I got from subscribers so now they have their own place looking over me while asleep which means that this is now empty which also means that I can probably put more shoes in there yeah I think it looks really good though like like this adds a lot of well storage space and it just uh, I think it just looks good that as well that looks freaking dope as well so again guys I just want to thank you guys again for sending me all these cool things I'm gonna do a little quick cleanup of this mess and then we are gonna go somewhere and get a new monitor <laughs> it's monitor it's monitor month here in the in my place because this one is freaking it, it, it broke kind of look if I wanna like do you, do you see these damn colors it, it it's like super blue and stuff but that monitor is already like five years old or something probably even older and I was contemplating like just getting rid of that thing, this monitor, but it's just so nice. Like having, I basically have like five places where I can do something. So for example, I usually always have my Spotify here and I usually have Skype or Discord or something over there. And then I can like have three uh, pages of, of internet over here. Or, or or like two if I, if I want to watch a video over here. Or if I want to play some League, then I have my League client over here. And then I'll just like swipe this over here or I can do like this and this or something. I don't know man, I, I just really love having all this all this screen space. So definitely not getting rid of this of this uh, lower monitor. We are actually gonna get like the same aspect ratio as the as the upper one. So this is this is ultra wide. And I'm also getting an ultra wide uh, down there, but not as big as, as the main one. That one is 34 inches and now I'm getting a 25 inch screen which is like this one is also pretty high because it's just 16 by 9 aspect ratio and a new one will be will be wider but it will actually be a little bit lower so it's also better for like multiple applications on one screen and stuff like that it's great it's great Okay guys, we're already back home. That was fast, wasn't it? Well, here is my monitor. Super freaking wide. Setup is looking pretty lit now. With a lot of screen space here and even more screen space here. Um, by the way, I am eating some quark because I was hungry as f- mm. And I have a little surprise for you. Let me just like show you the surprise, okay? Hey! <laughs> you weren't even ready. <laughs> we are gonna do another cooking with Casimir. Hey. We're gonna make freaking pizza. But with we we are gonna make two pizzas. One with like normal stuff like cheese and stuff, and then one with freaking candy and Nutella and other. 
kinds of stuff and it's gonna be disgusting, but it's gonna be delicious. At the same time, we even, we even got this. I'm not gonna throw this into my head, but it's like struple waffle, but then in, in, <laughs> but then in a jar and it's freaking delicious. Well, at least I hope it's gonna be freaking delicious. And then we also have knacks. And, and Casimir actually has the great, terrible idea of making pizza though with yogurt and kind of stuff. I don't know how he's gonna do that, but he will explain it in three, two, one. Casimir, what are you doing? Fucking it up. No, not usual. Yeah, so I'm gonna make a pizza dough, um, <clears throat> but I don't wanna make a normal one, so I'm gonna try to make a healthy one with eggs, yogurt, um, oatmeal, and some salt and then for the sweeter ones we're gonna use protein powder from vibe um yeah that's just gonna work i guess oh damn how oh, is it how oh, sweet <laughs> wild <laughs> later okay so grap alles het is voorbij niet van beeld en we're also like gonna put these bad boys in the pizza it's probably gonna be really terrible. Which is the whole point. This is all for the not sweet pizza. Oh, but this is with salt and pepper. Oh, I thought you also added the uh, protein powder. No. Oh, okay. Okay, we can, we can also like um, add some apples and bananas to the, to the sweet pizza. This is what we're probably gonna do. And we probably have some other shit in your fridge too that we can eat. We have some risotto, but I think, don't think that's gonna be a very good idea. Not like our other ideas are very good. That's even worse. What's this? Oh, banana, baked banana. And boy, that's one big ass square pizza. It's Casimir is now making the tomato sauce, I think. Yeah. For the normal pizza. Yes. How is the dough doing? Yeah, quite all right, I guess. I'm really curious to see how that's gonna work out. What's going on in the potato, I mean in the tomato sauce? In the potato sauce. In the potato sauce? Um, I did some olive oil in a pan. Did some onion and garlic with it. With then it? Then some paprika? Yeah, I guess. Paprika powder. Yeah. Same. You know what I mean. So I'm no uh, tomato puree. <laughs> puree. 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 Like it's really, tomato. really concentrated potato yeah. shit. Tomato, tomato <laughs> shit. Why do I keep messing this up? I can't. I did some fresh tomatoes in there. Switch it up. Some salt, pepper, oregano, basil. And now it's just waiting. I spent a day with you, make a year. Lekker eruit knippen. Why we even gotta take it here? It's not that bad, I guess. This might actually work. Put that thing down. Put in some vanilla, vanilla flavored, flavored protein, protein powder, powder from five seconds. So this is the dough for the sweet for the sweet pizza. And I'm gonna I'm gonna and add this is the dough for the other pizza. Yeah. And I'm gonna add I'm gonna add some uh, almond milk a little bit for some sweetness. This guy's crazy. This guy's off the hook. More protein. More 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 more. more. Yeah 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's a food baby if I've ever seen one. <laughs> that's a baby and a half, man. What did you do to that thing? <laughs> like, how is this gonna turn into pizza, though? Because, like, it's still pretty floppy. What are you doing, even? I'm just trying to make, like, a edge, like, uh, some sort of crust. Uh, uh, <laughs> this is pretty much just cooking with bram, only, like, with good ingredients. The same, like, ridiculous um, improvisation station nation. Creation. I see cheese. I see cheese. I, I get happy. Start with like the. Let's just make four. What time is it? It's freaking half past eight, almost quarter past eight, and it's. I'm hungry. I want to eat. Let's just make like. Oh yeah, quarters. And pizza going out of the oven. This is the sweet one. Oh, and these are our creations. I made this one and this one. This is with spinach oh, this and so room, room cheese. And this is with like sausage kind of things and cheese. Pro tip, pro tip, Casimir didn't do this, but you always want to put the sausage 
like with the with the with the inside on top, so it will like roast. Or something. And then and then Casimir has also one with spinach and, and like normal cheese, and one with cheddar and and, and stuff, and, and it's gonna be freaking delicious. There's and something we're gonna make this one with, with 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 weird stuff like 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 super matches and and freaking marshmallows and other stuff and. Stop! I it Yeah, Hey! Shut the fuck up, mate! Jesus! This one's gonna be the best. This one's gonna be the best. This one has the, has the like, the... The caramel things. Freaking delicious, man. Mm, I'm gonna put some decoration in here, in between the, the things. Because presentation value is very important. I learned that from my uncle Gordon Ramsay. He always uh, told me to put uh, sour mats on the on the pizza, so uh, I just did. So oh happy. damn boy! This one's gonna be the best. Man. <laughs> Holy fuck! So freaking thick. Oh. Like, but is it actually like hard now, the pizza? I don't think so. No, no, I don't think so either. Nah, but we <laughs> nah. just eat it yeah. and, and not pizza. <laughs> I think it's gonna be good. This is it. not pizza, pizza. Dude, what you can do? So this one's mine. This one's Casimir's. This one's mine, and this one is Casimir. Mm. Oh man, <laughs> it's really good. <laughs> All the cheese, man. I mean, the pizza is not pizza. What, what do we call this? Pizza, wet pizza. A wet pizza. I really like this one though. No, I'm not expecting too much from it. Just good old cheese and spinach. Mmm. Oh. You really taste the toma tomato sauce yeah. in this one. I haven't eaten. Cooking with like Brasimir, Bramley, Bram's fan page. Don't take screenshots while we're eating this, please. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, the normal cheese is really nice. I put the old cheese on top. But it adds like extra. It gives a little taste. So this one has chicken, cheese, Cheers. sausage, cheese, I don't know even anymore. Uh, but it's thick. It's a crack, crack sausage. <laughs> <laughs> like my, 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 my plan behind this was that the fats would get like a bit, a bit out of the sausage. Like it, it would get, like get a bit of uh, crispy. 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 crispy, crispy. But that didn't happen because it wasn't in the oven long enough. And a complaint. <laughs> we are here. No, I'm just kidding. We just ate <laughs> the pizza and uh, like the salty one. Better than you I mean, expected. You mean the pizza or the? Yeah, the pizza, like the. No, pizza, the soft pizza. Or the because it was like the the yita, 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 yeah, yogurt pizza. Because like the the crust, the the pizza dough, it wasn't like crispy at all. It was just like a fried egg, <laughs> basically. But it tasted like really good. Yeah, the first one, man. That the first one was honestly the best. Yeah, the it was first like one was the best. Definitely. A lot of cheese. The cheddar was just melting yeah. in your mouth, and like Casimir takes this one. The oven is still on, and we're gonna put the sweet one in there. What do, do I want to like? Nah, just time, yeah. These are time. We have some coffee. We have some freaking delicious ass pancakes. No, I mean yeezy cakes. Pizza. We call nah. it pizza. Whack a pizza. Whack a pizza, boys. Let's get it. Hey, you. Yeah, let's get it. Uh -huh. Oh. What smell is crazy? Oh! Holy oh, Jesus Christ, boys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> this is so good. The marshmallow is king, boy. That's crunchy. Yeah, man, the crunchiness. This is the real coffee from. Uh, Brandsack. From the Brandsack. Brandsack. From the Brandsack. I, I, I also gave Casimir some coffee. It's the best. I think it's gonna be between this one. Yeah. This has walnuts. And a lot of but, marshmallows. But are we gonna taste that one now? Or this one? No, we're just gonna do this one because yeah, this one doesn't this look one, that impressive. Are, no. Oh! Whoa! This is the level! This is the level! Oh my god! Triple level! For the win! WWW! Ha! Fuck! Da, da, da. 
It's gonna be between the, these two. Yeah. This one's really crunchy. But this one was pretty good. Yeah, man. I, I didn't was, I expect like it. Better it. Than yeah. The first one, yeah, definitely. Like this one has the has the caramel sauce thing. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yep. Mm, crunchy. I went for the caramel and the caramel. Mm. Oh, this is oh, this is baked banana okay, on it. This is like fried, baked, deep fried banana kind of thing. Marshmallow, walnuts, and peanut butter on the bottom. Ooh, this fun. Oh, walnut. Walnut makes it really different, man. Got all the other ones. No, I think it's a peanut butter. Mm, both, I think. I like the intenseness of the caramel, though. Yeah. I think. Yeah. Yeah. Ah! I'm gonna give you the win for the sweet one. Thanks, man. Thanks. Mm. Kismir, I want to do a new thing. Every time that I'm here, people always ask about your shoes. So, I want you to tell something about a shoe. Just one shoe. Every time that I'm here. So, pick a shoe and tell the story behind the shoe. Like something about the shoe, but also like what the shoe is for you or something, or how you got it and, and stuff. <sighs> I just don't know where to start. Okay. I'm just gonna. Okay, so you say every time you come here, so we just start with this one. Okay. This is a Nike Air Max 1, some canvas purple ish one. I don't think it really has a name though. Um, but uh, the Air Max made me wanna start like the sneaker world thing. Ah, this is a good, it, like, uh, good uh, yeah, first shoe. I really too. like this silhouette. whole shoe silhouette. And um, yeah, th th this made me wanna come into uh, sh into the sneakers, sneaker world. And um, I saw this pair of sneakers at this uh, guy at a, with a like really cool photo. And I was asking the guy like, yeah, how do you get it? And he was like, yeah, there's one in your size for sale on Instagram for th from this girl. And I was like, okay. And so I DM'd her. Just asked her like, hey, can I buy it? And it was only like 80 euros or something. It wasn't much, was still unworn and nice. stuff. But she left in the States and oh. she sent it to me. And I was like really waiting for it. And it didn't come and it didn't arrive. So I texted her and she was like, yeah, I don't know. I still got the receipt, blah, blah. And then all of, yeah, after like half a year I was like I'm never gonna get it right so and then I guess like eight or nine months later some a package arrived in my mailbox and there were the shoes nice so it's like and, and you didn't buy any other shoes in those eight months maybe I did I don't know it was like a really a really big surprise yeah, for me. it yeah, was like nice. whoa they're here <laughs> finally those and I was like so your happy addiction. yeah not particularly those but these like, but like the Air Max one yeah and, yeah. and are these the first one that you've actually like bought of someone else? Um, no, I don't think so. Oh, okay. No, I don't they have those anymore. They still have those? Oh, no, okay. I sold those. Oh. Did you did you actually sell anything to one of our viewers? No. Oh, then we are gonna make some promotion again. Kazmir has a lot of shoes, as you can see, but he is selling some. So if you want to sell, if you want to buy some of Kazmir's shoes. Uh, then you can click this link in the description. For example, I got these for sale. Come on, these are, these are really, really beautiful. beautiful. I can I continue because these, these are really beautiful too. I the oh, fabric, the dope. fabric is Yo, so soft. Yo, do you soft. remember when we bought those? Like, yeah, I do. We bought those in Baku, right? Yeah, we tried so hard and then oh, I but never it didn't wore work them out. Did, did it like, work? Did we actually manage to get those? I can't remember how I no. got it. We were in Baku for Still. for a competition in 2015 for the European Games, and like their shoes dropped on on one day. So we were we were sitting ready with our computers and stuff, and I, I can't remember if we actually managed to get them. I don't remember. But like some somehow he did manage to get them. If it wasn't for that day, then he bought and them. I got these cool essence for sale. It's like like. They're, they're so, so cool, cool on, on you. you. I <laughs> bet they're cool on you. They're like 120 euros. Only or something. 120. It's not. They're like brand. You can even you lick it. Like, uh, <laughs> it's like brand new. And if and you can if you can, can prove, prove that you are subscribed, subscribed to me, Casimir will put 10, 10 bucks off or 10 percent. Yeah, yeah, I can give you 10, 20 oh, percent discount. Just message me on Instagram, Facebook, or whatever. I can give you a discount if you can prove that you subscribe to Prem's channel. So there are two things left. One. Thanks for watching. Please, Thank you. please do a thumbs up or comment and don't forget to subscribe. And the second thing, peace. See ya.